While Jakob Suisse and Heng Kiang have stepped down from ministerial office, I am glad they will continue to serve Singapore in other capacities. I trust they will make themselves available to help the younger ones and keep on providing ideas and feedback to the team. And I look forward to the three of them remaining active for many years to come. Let me also thank, thank Zaki, Xueling and Wu Ming for organizing tonight's function. It's appropriate for the incoming POHs to recognize the outgoing office holders. And it's also a reminder that we're only here because our predecessors have paved the way for us. And one day, it will be our turn to make way for our successors. The transition to the fourth generation leadership is well underway. Younger ministers now head two-thirds of the ministries, and this process will continue for both ministers and the MPs. To those who have run your laps and passed on the torch, you can take pride in your service. You've done your duty. You've contributed to Singapore's success. You're leaving Singapore and Singaporeans in a better place. We wholeheartedly thank you and also thank your family members and especially your spouses. Without them standing by your side, being supportive and understanding, making sacrifices and taking care of the kids, it will have been tough for you to focus on your public duties and to keep up what you have been doing all these years. Maria and Elaine are not able to be here today and Ibon passed away a few years ago, but we owe them too a debt of gratitude. To those who have taken up the torch and will come after you, may you carry on the spirit of service and stewardship of those who came before. Build on what they have done and lead Singapore to new and even greater heights. Thank you very much. <laughs>